Hi, my name is Thomas Foster. Welcome to the Carrion Music Tech Conference. Thank you for having me. I'm a music producer based in Salzburg. With my company Foster Kent, we produce jingles for TV and radio stations. You can hear our work on the biggest stations in America, Russia, China and Europe. Recently, I had a crazy idea. I thought to myself, is it possible that artificial intelligence could do my job and compose music for me? So I could relax on the most beautiful beaches while the AI makes money for me. Well, let's have a look together if it works. The big change when it comes to artificial intelligence in music for me was in September 2016 when Sony CSL used AI to compose a new Beatles song. They feed the AI with lyrics and melodies of all the Beatles songs and then the AI wrote and composed a song in the style of the Beatles. Ladies and gentlemen, Daddy's Car, a song composed by artificial intelligence. Listen to that, how cool is that? Okay, if the French can do it, we can do it too. And which company is probably one of the best when it comes to AI? I would say Google. Google created Magenta, which is not a phone carry company. No, Google's Magenta is an open source project to use AI to compose music. The best part is that you can use it for free as plugin in one of the most common music programs, Ableton Live. I use Ableton Live every day, so let's load Google's Magenta in Ableton as a plugin to see what it can do for us. I had a great idea for a new melody. Three short notes, one long note. Listen to the melody I made. Just a spontaneous idea from me, right? Um, so in Google Magenta there are different modes. Let's start with the mode Continue, where you put in a melody, that's what I did right now, and you ask Magenta to continue this melody. Magenta creates four variations for us. Let's listen to four variations of my little idea. Okay, let's uh, try another mode. There's the mode interpolate. So you can give the system two melodies and it interpolates between both. This time, to be on the safe side, we use two melody out from major hits. First, a very beautiful melody, Somewhere Over the Rainbow. Everybody knows it. And then we use another major hit, Billy Chain from Michael Jackson. She said, I am the one, because the kid is not my son. And now we use Machanta to create a new major hit by interpolating between Somewhere with the Rainbow and Michael Jackson. Okay, if you see that now and say, wow, I think this will really be the next hit, then please contact me. You can finance the project with pleasure. I send you my account number. 
but I think we should not be satisfied with open source projects. If you want to be successful, you have to invest money first. So I buy what I think is the best program for composing music with AI, the Op Composer. The Op Composer is a software that you can buy that generates complete arrangements drum beats, bass lines, chord progressions and melodies. You can play this arrangement with the MIDI standard sounds or you can send them to another program to use your own sounds. Let's open the AWP Composer. We choose a tempo, let's say 150 BPM. We choose a key, what about A minor? Okay, and now we take a theme and put it into our timeline. What means that the op composer starts to compose and arrange a first theme of eight bars. Okay. The op composer uses the MIDI standard files and they don't sound so good. So uh, let's put down the level of the sounds and send the notes to our software Ableton Live where we have better sounds. We start with the drums, then the bass, we have a pad, the arpeggiator and the lead instrument. Hmm. I don't know what you think at this point. For my part, I will continue to do my work by myself and use the AI to clean my floor. If you want to learn more about music production or you want to see this video again, then come to my YouTube channel, Thomas Foster Music Production. Thanks for having me. Always stay creative. Cheers.